The emergence of Carrick, a novel DeFi protocol, was anticipated to inject dynamism into the cryptosphere. However, the euphoria surrounding its launch has been overshadowed by allegations of impropriety. Accusations have surfaced from members of the Terra Classic community, casting a shadow over Andalusia Labs, the entity responsible for Carrick. These accusations assert that Andalusia Labs orchestrated the misappropriation of a staggering 200 million USTC tokens, valued at approximately $7 million. In response, Carrick has vehemently denied any complicity in the purported misappropriation, dismissing the claims as unfounded FUD, fear, uncertainty, and doubt. Conversely, Andalusia Labs has adamantly asserted ownership of the tokens, contending that they were rightfully granted for the explicit purpose of ensuring Carrick's restaking pools. This contentious debacle has not only raised serious questions about the integrity of Andalusia Labs, but has also cast doubt on Carrick's credibility within the DeFi ecosystem. The genesis of the controversy can be traced back to the allocation of 200 million USTC tokens from the Terra community pool to Ozone, a decentralized insurance protocol under the stewardship of Risk Harbor. The collapse of Terra in May 2022 precipitated a seismic shift in the crypto landscape, prompting the transfer of blockchain stewardship to the Terra Classic community and the rebranding of the Terra stablecoin as Terra USD Classic USTC. A meticulous timeline reveals the convoluted trajectory of the 200 million USTC tokens, beginning with their transfer to Risk Harbor's wallet and culminating in subsequent transactions to enigmatic accounts on prominent exchanges. Moreover, anomalies surfaced during the audit of the UST underwriting contract, coinciding with the unceremonious removal of critical details from the original proposal. The response from the Terra Classic community has been swift and resolute as efforts to reclaim the misappropriated funds have yielded partial success. Despite this, Carrick's steadfast refusal to entertain governance proposals seeking the restitution of the remaining funds has incited considerable discontent among community members. The ensuing discord has underscored a broader issue of accountability and transparency within the DeFi space, prompting impassioned calls from crypto privacy advocates for increased scrutiny and oversight. Concurrently, Amidst the maelstrom of controversy, the Luancy price fell 5.14% in the last 24 hours amid market-wide sell-off, with the price currently trading at $0.0001022. The 24-hour low and high are $0.0001067 and $0.0001008, respectively. Moreover, trading volume decreased slightly in the last 24 hours, indicating a decline in interest among traders.